what is going on guys i hope you've been well it's sean boyle momentum 360. in this video i'm going to be showing you how to pick blog topics to generate higher leads for your virtual tour business let's get started what's going on guys if you haven't yet stop go to our youtube channel click subscribe and click that little bell too so you get notifications whenever we post a new video you will be the first person to know Thank you so much for the support, and now the video you've been wanting to watch. All right, all right, all right. What is going on, guys? Different video format today. We're going back to the old G style that I used to make these videos, and it feels good. It feels good to get back in the swing of things and uh, just do this via Loom because it's fantastic. So really, really happy about that. But either way, in this video, I'm going to be showing you a free, easy way to generate blog topics that are literally going to equal transactions in your business. So let me kind of explain what I mean by that. So when we're picking blog topics, we want to obviously have the highest keyword or key phrase in terms of search volume with the lowest difficulty so we can rank easy and we can generate as much volume as we can. But the question is, is all that volume that we are then going to rank for translate to sales? That's a good question because if, Again, I'm using an example for me. If I'm trying to rank for, I don't know, like Eiffel Tower virtual tour, that isn't necessarily going to translate to money to a client. Whereas if virtual tour services near me, that's a very direct local search, which that definitely will uh, equate to transactions online. So you want to be very strategic in the way that you're picking these blog topics. And I'll show you a very easy, 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 straightforward way right now where you can go ahead and do that. All right. So what you want to do is go to semrush.com. It doesn't matter if you have an account, we have a paid account, but you can do this with a free account. It's very, very simple. And what you're going to do, what I like to do, is just type in a very broad key phrase, right? Keyword, key phrase. So let's just type in virtual tours, right? That's because that's what we do. That's where the money is made. And I would say this is the a good topic that we can get a lot of other key phrases and topics around. So as this is going to download, you can see you can pick, obviously, from all keywords, questions, broad match phrase match, exact match. You can channel this by different volume, by different keyword difficulty, CPC, all this stuff. But what I want you guys to focus on today is the intent, which is very, very important. And it's actually a new feature on SEMrush, which I'll talk about right now. So there's four intent blog topics that you can talk about. You can see right here, they're informational, navigational, commercial, and transactional. We obviously want the transactional one because that's where we're going to get clients from. Got it? So just to go over what all these mean, information is really a user who wants to be uh, given an answer to a specific question. So like how much do virtual tours cost? Boom, it costs this much. That would be a good example. I'm just using questions that pertain to my business, you guys can pause this video and think and write down questions that pertain to your business and then keep watching the video. Navigational, this is, I guess, to find a specific page or site. So where is like you know, directions to photography company near me or something like that, right? So it's navigated to a specific company so you can get directions there or something like that, right? Maybe to a studio, that would make a lot more sense. Commercial is to investigate like a brand or services. So like Matterport, Rico Theta, Cloud Pano, those are very, very, very popular brands. So this would be an example of a commercial if I was to rank for Cloud Pano or Matterport or something like that, right? And now you have the transactional key phrase, which is my favorite, and it's going to be yours too, where the user wants to complete an action. It's a conversion. They want to pay you for your services, okay? So what I like to do is find, again, the highest key phrase in terms of volume with the lowest difficulty with the transactional intent. So you're hitting on all the marks. It's a lot better to do that than hit on both of those marks with high volume and low difficulty, but the intent is off because if the intent's off, you're not getting the most bang for your buck for your blog topic. So what I like to do is simply hit transactional, apply it. This is going to take a little bit of time. 
And it's automatically going to uh, pair you up with key phrases that have the highest volume and the lowest difficulty. And you can sift through. We're going to do this right now in real time to kind of show you what I would recommend to pick. All right. So let's do this. And there's going to be a lot of like brand keywords in here, like Metropolitan Museum, Smithsonian, New York uh, University, all these. But let's go through these. So virtual college tours. This is a pretty good key phrase, I would say. Decent volume, somewhat low, not low, but I would say intermediate difficulty, but you still can rank for this. Uh, Google virtual tour. That's I wouldn't recommend doing that pretty high in terms of the keyword difficulty. Let's try to find like a Goldilocks one. That's that's perfect. So let's keep going down, go down, down, down. And again, these are things that, oh, this is perfect right here. Google Maps virtual tour. So this is both a informational and a transactional intent, decent volume, and again, intermediate difficulty. That's another good one. Uh, but, but, but what's another good one? Virtual campus tour, same thing for the most part. Mobile home virtual tour, maybe. If, if you want to get a virtual tour of a mobile home, that's okay. Uh, let's keep plugging through. School virtual tour. This is great. This is a perfect example. So again, you have decent volume, low keyword difficulty now, and it's transactional. So this, I would say, is an optimal level uh, keyword or key phrase to use for writing your blogs. OK, and I, I can continue doing this for days, but now you guys know exactly what to do to check out blog topics, because the more blogs you write with transactional intent, not necessarily chasing those clout keywords that have so much volume and low difficulty, but they're not really pertaining to your business in terms of the actual service that you provide, it's going to get you customers. It's not going to work. So what you want to do is follow this video. It's very, very simple. And you should be able to start ranking very high for these key phrases and keywords with low difficulty that have transactional intent that will generate leads to your business. So guys, that is it. Very quick video. But if you have any questions, leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe. Sean Boyle, Momentum 360. I love making these videos. We make weekly videos providing free content for virtual tour companies that are looking to grow, as well as providing our own on-demand services in all 50 states and 15 countries as well. Guys, thank you so much. Looking forward to talking on the next one.